Morning, everyone. There's nothing better than waking up to a sunny summer's morning. Today, I'm going to share with you how I like to get ready. Starts off in the shower. I love this argan oil conditioner. I use this first, which prepares my hair for shampooing. If you haven't tried this shampoo, I highly recommend it. It's so creamy. We roll with the windows down. Meet up my new favorite body wash is the melon one because it smells like watermelon, which to me screams summer. And as always, my cleansing wash, which I've been using for years. Okay, toothpaste. It's black toothpaste. I know, it's really weird, but my teeth feel super clean after I used it, so I had to share it with you. Here's me right out of the shower, ready for makeup. As I will be in the sun, I already applied SPF, but I use a different one on my face and neck so that it doesn't break me out. For primer, I'm using this spray because it's lightweight, but it really helps to make my makeup last. This is my favorite concealer at the moment. Amazing coverage, but I'm not a big fan of the sponge on the top, but I love the texture. I'm trying to let my skin breathe, but I want a little coverage, so this tinted moisturizer will protect the skin while giving a slight amount of coverage. Grabbing a small powder brush and my favorite powder, I'm just going to pinpoint this on the T-zone on any areas that I need to set. By the way, this powder is sweat and waterproof. I'm loving this blush by NYX. I use this for contouring and I use the same brush because it's multitasking. Now for the brows, I'm using three different pencils, which might seem excessive. I start with a pencil that's lighter than my hair and I use this to outline my brows. When outlining the top, however, I always leave a slight gap just to keep it natural looking. With a pencil the same shade as my hair, I line right in the middle of the brows to add some depth. And to finish, I use my favourite brow brush to blend everything perfectly. Brow gel will help keep the shape and lock the pencil in for you. And the last pencil I use is a concealer pencil. I use this to define the brow shape and blend it out with my fingertips. All right, all right. Turn on, kick it and, and that's the brows done. So with a mixture of powder and contour, I'm blending this all over my lid. This will work as a base because it's waterproof, but I'm just gonna keep it like this and move on to eyeliner. I'm loading one side of the brush up with gel liner and I'm using the angle of the brush lining it up with the corner of my eye, and you're done. Blend it into the lash line, and it's incredibly easy to use, and it's my new favorite thing. Curl your eyelashes and apply a waterproof mascara. This doesn't budge, it's awesome. Me and my mom have been trying out this lip plumper, and it actually really works. I'm gonna let it do its magic and move on to the hair. I rough dried my hair slightly and applied a heat defense, but I'm going to just apply a little bit more. My new obsession is the Remington Silk Waving Wand. This comes with a glove and you basically wrap the hair around it, hold for a few seconds and then release. Don't touch the waves until they cool and then I lack a little bit of texture so I'm adding that back in. Repeat this all over, making sure to allow it to cool and then spray, but be careful with this spray because if you overdo it, it can go white. For perfume, I prefer a body spray for the summer because it's very lightweight and I apply this all over, like all over. <laughs> for lip gloss, I'm going to add a pop of colour. And that is the makeup done. The fake tan that you all wanted to know about is this one. And I'm using this brilliant fake tanning mitt to apply this. It's a mousse with a guide color and it's very easy to apply and develops very quickly. I'm naturally very pale so this is a safe way for me to color without sitting in the sun. And my dog Rocco approves, I think. My outfit is just fun and light. I'm wearing some wedges because to me they're really summery. My top and high-waisted shorts are from Pennies. The shorts are super comfortable and I only recently got them so you should be able to still get them. 
All my accessories are also from Penny's because I shop there a lot. And that's the finished look. Thank you so much for watching.